A coat of arms is a heraldic visual design on an escutcheon, surcoat, or tabard. The coat of arms on an escutcheon forms the central element of the full heraldic achievement which consists of shield, supporters, crest, and motto. A coat of arms is traditionally unique to an individual person, family, state, organization, or corporation. These are the top four coat of arms from European royalty. 4. The Coat of Arms of the Knights Hospitaller The Coat of Arms of the Knights Hospitaller is a white cross on a red background. The cross is a symbol of the Knights' commitment to Christianity and their dedication to helping those in need. The red background represents the blood spilled by the Knights in battle and their willingness to sacrifice themselves for the sake of others. The Coat of Arms is a reminder of the Knights' dedication to their order and their commitment to helping those who are less fortunate. 3. The Coat of Arms of the Teutonic Order the Teutonic Order is a German religious order that was founded during the Crusades. The coat of arms of the Teutonic Order is a white cross on a black background. The black background represents the darkness of sin and the white cross represents the light of Christ. The Teutonic Order was founded to fight against the Muslims in the Holy Land, but they eventually became a military order that fought against the pagans in Europe. The Teutonic Order was very successful in converting the pagans to Christianity and they also became a very powerful political force in Europe. 2. The Coat of Arms of the Order of the Temple The Coat of Arms of the Order of the Temple is a simple yet powerful design. A red cross is the central focus, with a white background. This symbolizes the blood that was shed by the Knights Templar during the Crusades. The cross is surrounded by a green wreath, which represents the Templars' dedication to God and their service to the Church. Above the cross is a sword, which represents the Templars' military prowess. The coat of arms is completed by the Latin motto, Non nobis domini, not unto us, O Lord, which encapsulates the Templars' humble attitude and their focus on serving God and the Church. This coat of arms is a reminder of the Templars' sacrifice and dedication. It is a symbol of their strength and courage, and it stands as a reminder of the great things that can be accomplished when we serve God and others. 1. The coat of arms of the Kingdom of Jerusalem. The coat of arms of the Kingdom of Jerusalem was a simple design consisting of a white cross on a red background. The cross was a symbol of Christianity and the red background represented the blood shed by Christ and the martyrs. The coat of arms was used by the crusaders as a rallying point and as a symbol of their cause. It was also used on their banners and shields. The coat of arms was a simple design, but it was very effective in communicating the message of the crusaders. We hope you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more content like this.